Hello friends, welcome to DP Tutorials. In this tutorial, let us learn about how to create a WBS in chart view in Primavera P6. Rather than a tabular WBS view, chart view provides more compelling hierarchical diagram of the schedule. Let us prepare a schedule of construction of a house in this example. So first thing is that we need to start with the creation of WBS. So go to the WBS section. By default, we will be having the standard table view of the top level WBS like this for our project, which is house by name. In the top layout tool section, we should click on choose chart view. The chart view of the schedule will be displayed like this. Right click on the top level WBS and choose plus add from this menu. Clicking on this plus button on the right side toolbar to insert the WBS elements like this. I am inserting three WBS elements. Okay. You can notice that every time we are inserting a new WBS, it is being a child of the currently selected WBS. Now select the first WBS and go to the general tab in the details at the bottom and in the name field enter as pre-construction and the next level WBS as construction and the next WBS as key milestones. To fit these WBS elements into your screen, right click, go to zoom and select zoom to best fit. We can adjust the levels by using the arrows in the right side or simply using the drag and drop trick like this. To organize the WBS elements in the proper sequence, we need to play with this drag and drop trick. Once our level 1 WBS is done, we need to right click on pre-construction WBS and select add and name it as engineering. Again add and name it as excavation. Right click, go to zoom and select zoom to best fit again. Now left click on this excavation and drag and drop on the pre-construction WBS. You will notice that excavation has come before the engineering. To adjust this sequence, drag and drop the engineering into the pre-construction so that you can bring the engineering into first position like this. You can play with the design part by going to the view tab and go to align children and select either of these three options to adjust the chart view display like this. So this would be the simple example of WBS in chart view. So friends, this is all about how to create WBS in chart view in Primera P6. If you have entered this tutorial, please give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe DP Tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.